Hello everyone, I am IA Roadkill and we are playing Farming Simulator 19. We are homesteading Grizzly Mountain with hard economy and no loans. We are playing on the PlayStation 4 and this is episode 38. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons please. Thank you. Alrighty, let's see about these sugar beets. Pretty sure they're ready to go. Remove tops. Yes indeedy. Well, let's look at the aminals first. Keep them producing. Oh, they're dirty. Kind of figured they would be. Been neglecting them while I've been doing the timber work. Which... First time for me on this map to ever have all that timber gone. Feels good. My arm's not feeling too bad either. Still aches pretty good. Uh, I lost the pillow, which means I can move my elbow a little bit now. Let's see, how long until these pigs start making us money? Oops, I went the wrong way. I have 57 sheep. Pigs can go to what, 300? So it's going to be a while, I guess. Yep. Alright, we need to fill their sugar beets up and... I don't know what the sheep total is, but hey, we get there, we get there. I guess I could dump some more of that straw in there. Well, next time. It looked okay. <gasps> oh my goodness. I did not return this. I was going to return that. Well, we got her for another day, I guess. Daggone it. I have never purchased my sugar beet equipment. I need to go do that. And I need to buy some little thing that just runs me around here. But it'd always be in the wrong place, I guess. Uh, let's see. I need, I need to take a tractor anyway to bring it back. You know what I was thinking about doing? Um, let's see, we have this tractor and the little one, right? That's it. I keep going the wrong one. Garage. Owned. The case and the dudes far. Argo Star. Um, yeah. Well, I was thinking about getting a worker started on that grass. Um, well, let's buy our sugar beet stuff and see what we've got. I'm thinking about getting another tractor. Sugar beet, sugar beet, sugar beet. Beet technology, there we go. And this is what I normally do. That one and this one. Yeah. Okay. 
and it says 85 horsepower, 185 horsepower. 185 horsepower. I don't think my little dutes is that much. So he can't run that alone. But The red one sure can. And I'm saying red one because I can't remember what the name of it is. What are you? Your case? Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. So that was 120,000. 85. I'm pretty sure he is 261. He is, in fact, 261. All right. Well, I'm going to get Sugar Beet started and think some more on what I want for another tractor. I obviously want to get larger. Um, maybe I need to look into... Getting a better semi-tractor. Oh, and did you see how I got rid of that tree and I don't own the property? Oops! Might be a little bit of a glitch in there. Ooh, and I haven't checked on the uh, water and fertilizer for those trees. We gotta make sure we keep good, healthy red apples on there for the tourists to buy. And I think I'm still waiting for my first paycheck on that. I haven't seen anything hourly. Okay. Yeah, this will go on the front. And this will go on behind. Just like a dot. That's an amazing piece of equipment. That and the potato harvester. So yeah, I'm pretty happy about that f empty open space right there. We need to get to plowing that. And I think I'm going to make one huge field. I was thinking about making two fields, but I'm going to make just one big field. You know, I should probably top the uh, end of it with grass. That might make sense. That way my harvester could turn around in the grass area. Hmm. I say, hmm. All right, let's drop the actual harvester right here. And let's bring the topper down here. Oh, you know what? That, oh, he doesn't have to have a front attachment. He can pull it. Let's drop that right there. And we will let this here little feller since he's got the little wheels Oh, I'm going to have to put little wheels back on the case to harvest, I think. All right, buddy, go to work. Take the tops off. Oh, why are you going to miss the very first ones?
There we go. All right. Let's see here. While he is topping, Well, maybe I'll see if they can do these at the same time. Whoops, I gotta go put narrows on here. Narrows, narrows, narrows. Customize. And you took my front end attachment off again. And you took the engine down to small. 261. There we go. Front loader attacher. Yes. Front type 2. I think I've been having one. What looks like the old one? I'm all about the old. That looks like an old one right there. Yeah. Okay, we'll go with four. Tires, that's what we came here for. Those are goofy looking. There we go. Oh, what's costing me? Oh, I didn't want the front loader attacher. Oh, I bet you were yelling at me, weren't you? No, I don't want the front loader attacher. I want... That front attacher. Why do they call them the same thing? Hmm. Okay. Now we'll buy. Alright. Sorry about that. Okay, hook that up. Now, does this need to get unfolded? I haven't sugar beaded for a while. Uh, just turn it on. And I think it's down. We will head into the sugar beets and see what happens here. worker do this because he'll be able to do a straight line and get them all where I would be a missing. Is he missing a row on the edge? No, I don't think there's a I don't think there's a row in the grass edge there. I think it's down here at the end is where I had those last or those four plants sticking out, or however many it was. Well, we're not going to be able to make a down and back pass on here. What are you quitting for? Hey. I didn't say you could quit part way. You're supposed to do the whole thing. That's going to be inconvenient. Harvest? I did harvest, and I did miss. There, we got those four. And the one on the end. 
All right, now, how do we do boom out? There we go. We'll just leave that out since we're not going to have a tractor around. And they're going to get sugar beets now. And they should never run out again. 95% wasn't too bad, but we're going to try and keep her at 100 now. Oh, all done. All right. Okay, dokay. Oh, they put that away when it starts harvesting. No, stop. Stop what you're doing. Why are you missing? I'm gonna have to have my wheels on the ins or the sugar beets on the inside of my wheels. Did not remember that. Try that again. Oh, it looks like he's doing it. There we go. All right. And this is small equipment, but it's kind of a small field. You don't need a lot of sugar beets. Oh, I need to move uh, a wool bale. So, how many rows am I actually getting? One, two, I can't tell. So if I get like two rows less maybe, maybe he could go down and back before he gets full. And maybe he will take less. I loaded it up. Okay, so he's going to get one, two, three, four rows it looks like. Get four, one, two, one, two, three, four. Oh, he's getting five rows. I think he's only supposed to get four, but he's actually getting five. There it is. I was looking at plants and wheels. You know, I didn't know if this trailer would... ruin plants, but I guess not. How's that, pigs? Fresh sugar beets. Yeah, he gets five rows. If I set the tire on the outside of the plants, then he'll get five rows. I don't think that's too bad. Nope, oh, but he's going to stop here. I have to work it.
because I need to get rid of that tree. I'll snake through the trees here. I guess I know where I'm going to do timber work next. Uh-oh. Did I get over too far? Oh well. He may only get four rows this time. Not to worry. Oh, looks like he missed a row right at the beginning down there. gonna get to the end? No. Well, fudge brownies. They should really come up with another term instead of full grain tank. I don't believe you can call a sugar beet a grain. But that's just me thinking out loud. Probably, yeah, probably won't take as long in the tim ooh, in the timber over here. because the trees are farther apart. It's not as dense. Oh, oh, I think it's gonna be bad. I may have to regroup here. Yep, I'm missing. I didn't see that row that was sticking out there. And the little guy's almost done. I know you can do topping at the same time that you do harvesting, but oh, and he th thinks he's blocked. You are not blocked. What was I saying? I don't know. Hey, did you miss? No. I thought you missed right at the beginning there. Alright, we're going to do these... This short little row here, right? Okay. Just want to make sure that's what you were thinking about doing. And that's not the way I would have lined up for it, but sure, you can line up that way if you'd like. And miss a row. Hey, 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 I thought I started it. I did, I didn't lower it. There we go. What are you backing up for? You're worrying me, buddy. Oh, I can undo this. He's milking his time cards, what he's doing. Very quit. How come I heard him quit clear over here? It sounded like his engine stopped. Must have been an echo.
Uh, is this whole row good? I think. I think, I think, I think. So how are the pigs doing with sugar beets? Ooh, we're gonna... We're not gonna have room for all these sugar beets, I don't think. Maybe we will. I wasn't prepared to save any of these. Maybe we can just dump them on the ground for a little while. So if we're almost halfway, oh yeah, we'll have plenty of room for them. I'm pretty sure we'll have room for all of the sugar beets in the pen. So I'm curious when the explosion of pig multiplication is going to happen to where I will have to start hauling them I mean I'm looking forward to it but I need to make sure that I have Let's go ahead and start here. I need to make sure that I've got a uh, tractor, semi-tractor lined up. I have been wanting to do a grass experiment. Um, no, I didn't want that. I wanted to turn the hazard lights off. There we go. It'll go down as soon as I start to work her. I should probably move this. We will need to put this somewhere. It won't be used again for a very long time, but... You know me, I don't like to lease stuff. Come on. You can drive in reverse. I mean, reverse view. There.
Oh, I was talking about doing an experiment. I want to do a grass experiment uh, where... Ooh, I almost hit that again. Where you don't plow and you don't lime and all of that. My inspiration, Mr. Seely P, did a test, but I don't know that he did it correctly. Um, so I want to run my own little test and see what I come up with for results. getting there. Now, if I had the other field in sugar beets, we'd be using the big big equipment and a trailer and all that happy stuff, but this is a nice little field. And let's see, I know it needs to be plowed now. Will it need to be Lined. No, it does not need to be lined. What? Oh, for a second there, I thought it was getting double fertilized already. No, that's the part that's done. So, let's see. I need to take off plowing. Nope, it does not need to be fertilized yet. So we're gonna we're gonna have to wait until or er, lined. I mean. We're going to have to wait until it needs lined. And then I'm going to publish a little... I guess it's not a how-to. It would be a... Hey, turn off lights. There we go. I don't know what you call that. I guess I just label it as a test. How's the total doing? Ooh, we're past halfway. But we're past halfway of harvesting as well.
it's gonna be close oh my What do you think? Is it gonna fall fit in there or are we gonna have a little bit on the ground? One sugar beet harvest put to rest. All right, is it gonna fit? Oh, that's a sheep. I don't think so. Okay, is it all in? Nope. Well, what do we do now? Um. Well, I know what we do now. It's my piece of equipment. I'm not renting it, so... We'll just leave them in there. That's what we're gonna do. Um, I don't want to put it away or I'll forget their sugar beets in here. So I'm gonna leave it parked over here. Ooh, don't hit the bales. It's against my better judgment driving over here. There we go. Yay! Sugar beets are done. And that's been a while on my shoulder. We need to get rid of these narrows. So we'll come over here. That way I can do a little cut screen and rest my arm and you'll never know just like this well no wonder my shoulder hurts I've been at this almost an hour. So, we are going to let this be the end of this episode. And we will worry about doing the grass and getting another tractor and all that on the next episode. I would like to thank everyone who stayed to watch the entire video. If you found it enjoyable, I would appreciate it if you would hit that like button. If you would like to see more, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. That would be great for me. I appreciate it. And if you want to leave a comment, you may do so below. With that said, I would like to wish everyone, including you, a very wonderful day. Goodbye for now.